Hi everyone, I was set off early to get to Luton, set off the day before. Um, we were a little bit hungry, so Jane checked a good beer guide and we found a lovely pub to have, have lunch in, which is called... Yeah, the Georgian Dragon. The Georgian Gra Dragon, near sort of Fenny Drayton, isn't it, around that sort of area? So. It's a non-eaten way, yes. Non very nice, actually, just a very nice food. I'm well, going for the fish and chips, which looks a bit lovely. And Jane is going for the soup. Chili, 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 garlic bread. <laughs> Garlic bread is the future. I'll say to Jane on the way down that Luton, I thought, were the one team that kind of tore Blackpool apart and Bluefield Road and were well deserving of it. Yeah, I blocked that out of my mind actually. Yeah. That, well, that was horrible. The weather was horrible and everything that day, wasn't it? Yeah, so. they played really, really well. They we don't want that again. We don't, but I, I, I'm not so confident on this one if I'm being honest. We just honest. won 6-1, how can you not be confident? Well, yes, I don't. Six. We scored direct free kick and everything. <laughs> but not everybody's Birmingham City, are they? No, but it's a confidence thing, isn't it? They might have the swagger back tomorrow. So. Yeah, hopefully they have. I, I'll be interested to see what the team is tomorrow. Tomorrow, whether Super Jake Critch sticks with Jake, yeah, and starts with that team because it was really good, or whether he he does the normal thing and, and sets a team up to play more defensively against Luton, who are a good side. So we will see. We have to mention our match sponsor, Andy Higgins, our postal and data systems, he, for the best UK deals on Frankie machines, on mailing campaigns and mail shots. If your business is looking to save money on those sort of things, he is the guy to get hold of. His telephone number is 07809 or you can visit his website www.postalanddata.systems. Also, we'd like to mention that we will be looking for sponsors for next year's video, which is, you know, a if you're thinking of advertising your business, get in touch with us. And also, if you want to donate to the channel, there will be a link in the description below as well. Thanks for watching. We're going to get off now. We're going to carry on our way down to Luton. To get our tickets before the ticket off is shut. Yeah, we're going to get our tickets, <laughs> our replacement tickets. And we're staying at the Premier Inn, I think, in Luton, aren't we, as well? So, yeah. which, which has got all new beds and stuff. So, Jane was really not. beds. A new style of hypnos bed as well, so we're really looking forward to that. So we'll get a good night's sleep and we'll see you Guaranteed. at Luton tomorrow if you go in. Because of Jane forgetting the tickets, we've had to come to the ground on Friday and get some replacement tickets. We're getting a, a quick little tour of where, where we are, so <laughs> this is Friday. So, you might be coming in this way if oh, the bench. Okay. Oh, it's the first time I've been this ground to be honest. Yeah, Jane says it's a bit quirky. <laughs> That's the, that's the end, oh. that, yeah, where the end is, where you right. sit, that's, that's where what, you'll be sitting, right. in that end, and that's called the Oak Road. Oh, okay. God, it's unusual, isn't it? Yeah. That's the wooden stand. Uh, it's like a really old ground, isn't it? Isn't it just, eh? I love it. I, I, I love it, honestly. That's amazing. There we are. As soon as we came the day before, we forgot our tickets, we got a quick tour of the ground. What's your name? Tony Jeffries. Right, Tony. I'm the um, fire officer at Luton Town. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah. How long have you worked for Luton? 45 seasons. Have you? I actually have, yeah. Wow, fantastic. My 45th season. Well, thank you very much, thank you. No trouble, sir. Tony just took me on a little tour of the ground. Yeah. I'm just telling him that you forgot your tickets, so... Oh, no, uh... they won't let me have them either, sir. Well, they're not? No, I've got to, got to get them on the turnstile an hour before kick-off tomorrow, so... Oh. I'm a Luton fan from Holland. From Holland? Uh, yeah, we uh, actually came all the way over for the game tomorrow against Blackpool. Okay. Um, had a pretty good evening at the pub tonight. So. All right. This is your dad. Hi, dad. This is my dad. Hi. How are you doing? Yeah, this is our... We planned this trip two years ago because he retired and then the whole world closed down. Uh, so we're actually making up for uh, lost wow. times. I do believe that you're a big fan of uh, Lego. Yes. <laughs> FC Brixton. Yeah? Yes, definitely. So how long have you been following FC Brickstand? I think about three, three and a half years now. So James, a big, what are you, you're a big I am fan. a big Brickstand fan, yes. yes. They, they bring me a lot of joy in, in times when I need it. <laughs> so how come you follow Luton from Holland? Luton was the very first British stadium I've ever been to. Oh. Uh, back in 2006, uh, yeah. we were actually supposed, we actually went there, we went to the uh, uh, testimonial from Dennis Bergkamp at Arsenal. All right. and went to London the whole weekend and then one of our friends said, eh, well, let's go to a pre-season game in Luton. Never heard of it. <laughs> so we ended up at the stadium. I love the stadium. Um, pretty much 
followed them for a few seasons and then kind of lost track. Yeah. And then I think about six, seven years I started following them again. Oh, okay. And yeah, well, pretty much at the right time because they've been doing pretty good ever yeah. since. So, uh, so who's your following in Holland? Who's your team in Holland? I'm an FC Utrecht fan. Okay. I have a season ticket for it. We talked about it. 20, 20 years. 20, 21 years now? 21 years, right. So, uh, well, may the best team win tomorrow. <laughs> That'll be Luke. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, right. give us a score prediction quickly for tomorrow then. 2-1. Um, 2-1 to Luke. 2-0. 2 0 2-0. 2-0. Yes. Two nil. <laughs> two nil. Two nil. Two nil. Well, oh. if the scores are right tomorrow, they'll be in the playoffs. So yeah. It's going to be in the playoffs. So that's... Big achievements, so yeah, we'll see. It's a massive right. achievement, massive. Yeah, yeah, didn't expect that last uh, after last season, so we'll Good. see what happens. My name's Richard. Richard, uh, tell us all about you. You're a supporter of who? Uh, well, I'm actually a Bolton Wanderers supporter for Mercedes. Bolton Wanderers, isn't it? Yeah, so, uh, so what are you doing here? Um, I'm trying to do the uh, the 92 grounds in the Football League. Um, okay. And this is number 83 today. Wow. So uh, I've popped down to Luton. Um, I'm actually in with yourselves today with oh. the Blackpool <laughs> supporters. Couldn't get a ticket for the home end uh, right. for the money, so it's going to be a busy one, I think, today. So you're wearing tangerine today, then, are you? Uh, yes, I am, yes. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? Yes. Oh, thank you very yeah, much. Thank you. Tea, water. <laughs> oh, thank you. Look at this. This is fabulous, isn't it? Oh. They're all in tangerine. I do like it. Oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> thank is you. It, is it like a celebration? It's a, it's a celebration of Visakhi. Yeah. Visakhi is regarding Sikhism when the first Khalsa was created in 1699. Right. From that day. Now okay. on. Yeah. Nine, we'll have a browse. Lee Charles TV is. Oh my gosh, that is absolutely incredible. So this is <laughs> the first time I've been. This is the entrance to the ground. We're here that early getting the tickets because Jane forgot them. That we're here before the team coach. So here we go. <laughs> yeah, beating so, uh, everyone. We're beating the team coach. Yeah, so here's, well done. A, here's a team coach arriving. Yeah. There we are. There's our team coach. This is amazing. You, you actually go in the ground through the through terraced houses. It's actually built into the houses. It's very unique. Oh, yeah. oh, hello. Hello, mate. If you want to ruin your camera, you. take a picture of him. You can't come in. Sorry. <laughs> What's your reckon score? Two all. I tell you what. This just uh, makes me feel like a little kid. It's so long ago since we saw anything like this. It is unique. Here you go. It's actually, it is actually in the in the houses. All the terrace houses, it's in between them. It's phenomenal. Amazing. Wow. Amazing. I'll tell you what, this is a uh, first time I've been to Luton and I've got to say I like it. This is how grounds used to be. Oh yeah, it's smaller and uh... you won't see these, I mean it's it's like historic, isn't it? So I'm Gavin, it's my son Reese. Yeah, nice to meet you. I, uh, where do you reckon we're going to go on today? I think it's going to be 2 all, Lee. Yeah, 2 all. Point, point for the tangerines. Two. Oh, yeah. bowler late goal. Turn oh, into a prime Messi. Skin him on the wing. That's what I reckon is going to happen. You're not living in Blackpool anymore because your accent's. Uh... Oh, yeah, no, I was born in St. Albans. I'm a pusho. I'm... I don't speak like the North. It's me and this, it's me and this the Blackpool. Oh, obviously, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah so but you always followed Blackpool because you... Yeah, 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 since I was a, a baby, basically. Yeah, so we're the Connollys and the Dixons, and we're all the way from St Albans. All the way from St Albans. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And I'm from Blackpool. He lives in Blackpool. Yeah. Season ticket holder. We're in the Blackpool. I'm not, I'm not. You're not, OK. How do you reckon we're going to go on? 2-1, Pool. 2-1. 1-0. 1-0. How many goals are you at? 3. 3. Three now. We've got 2-2. 2-2. 2-1. 2-1. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-2. 2-
to. You've not travelled far then, have you? No, 20 minutes. 20 minutes. It's yeah. a home game for you then. Yeah, home game, that is, yeah. Uh, okay. First football game for some of these okay. kids. First football game? Yeah. Is that first game for you, isn't it? First game? What are you doing? What are you doing? So it's Jack, is it, yeah? Yeah, Jack. So, um, who, who's your favourite player? My favourite player is like Jordan Gabriel, I'll say. Jordan Gabriel, yeah, yeah great choice. Uh, how do you think we're going to go on to like next season? Do you think we're going to improve on this season? I think we will, yeah, with Critchley and everything. I think that we're going to improve. I think we're going to get more funds over summer. And I think we're going to fight for playoffs, I think, next season. Is there anything you'd like to see added to the team? What do you think we're lacking? I think we need a goal scorer, a striker. Yeah. Like yeah. Jerry Aix last season, but someone a bit better. Yeah. But bad goals for us constantly. Okay. Uh, what's your name? Joe. How do you reckon we're going to go on? Um, looking at the team, I'm hoping for maybe a 3 1 win. Oh, it's, it's kept Beasley in there. And Gary Medea. Oh, that's amazing, isn't it? Still got Joe on Shane and Jay on the back. Oh, 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 Jacob, what do you reckon today? You got your lucky hat on, obviously. Yeah. Um, I think the score's going to be 2 2 today. 2 2. It's going to be a hard game, but it's going to be 2 2. 2 2 today? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> My name is David and I was born in Blackpool many, many years ago, uh, 1968. When I was 24, I moved out to Indonesia. Last time I saw Blackpool was about two and a half years ago, just before the pandemic. I came to a home game against Shrewsbury and we got beat 1-0. And, uh, yeah, it's my first away game now since, I think, 1978, perhaps. Wow. My first away game. We're here in the quirkiest ground I've ever been to. I like it. It's kind of so bad it's good. That's the only way I can describe it. To get a man behind us has just said the toilets are like a museum. Yeah, yeah it's uh, it's honestly, it's historically, yeah. you're not going to see it. This stadium is a non smoking stadium and that's been used use electronic cigarettes. Thank you. What have got to take? 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 We don't know how we're going to go on today. It's a kind of a dead rubber game it's for us. Already. It's kind of nice actually. We don't often have this end of season nothing to play for thing. And it's kind of like a, it's like a carnival atmosphere today. It's yeah, it's very like odd. So we are now oh, on the side. We move to the pot. So Linus, Udovia. So let's welcome the teams out onto the pitch. Blackpool and Luton Town. So the half-time score here at Kenilworth Road is Luton Town 1, Blackpool 0. Don't know what's going on in the opening few minutes, but we've been the better team. 
should we're playing like it's one one and it should be but obviously it's not and we're just lacking that quality in front of the goal but see what the second half brings. Do you think we deserve to be one one? Yeah. I think we've been the better team overall. Not not to be in front, but definitely one one. If they can score with the chances we've had, we should have scored. Yeah, they've had a couple of chances. I mean, yeah, so, but nothing. Consider, you know, they're going for playoffs. We're, give, we're more than a match. Well, first of all, welcome to Coronation Street. <laughs> <laughs> um, the chips are good. Um, it, it, it was. Uh, we played okay. Um, lots of frustrating crosses, not landing on anyone's head. Yeah. The, the first goal was a bit of a sickener. It needs a change. What would you change at halftime? Um, I would possibly bring on, I think CJ Hamilton has done quite well down the right um, and one of them play on the other wing with Bowler on. I think if you, you do notice every time Hamilton gets the ball, two or three players yeah, immediately exactly. come over. Exactly, so, so if you put Bowler on that right and switch CJ back onto the left, something like that. That's, yeah. what, I, that's what we were thinking we'd do as well. And, uh, and I think that might... Might, might, might it's a bamboozle them because they couldn't cope with like both wingers coming They've in. Got to get slightly better crosses in as well. Yeah, we're getting good, in. good crossing positions and we're playing that, one or two. Final ball, ball in it. Paul, it's either too like close that. to the keeper or it's a, it's a flat, it's a flat low ball and it's, you know, okay. They don't work at this level. Can we come back? Yeah, we can get an equaliser, but um, I mean, I, I don't think they're playing that well. But uh, they've no. still, still, still had more shots on target than we have. What do you think of the ground? I think it's great. Oh, it's, it, I love those proper traditional grounds, like yeah. like Kenilworth. I really love QPR when we went to Loftus. Like, I love those old football grounds, yeah. like a good feel to them. Did you like the way we come in the entrance, like through the terraced houses, which I thought was amazing. <laughs> To admit if it was my garden I'd do it up a bit nicer <laughs> yeah for like, all the people that are coming around I'd yeah. put on a little show in the garden <laughs> like you know make it look a bit nice a flower arrangement or something yeah, but exactly. not just concrete <laughs> so what do you think of the first half do you think we should be one nil down or is it fair oh, I just I feel like we're on the back foot a little bit and yeah. um, the goal went in too easily and too it did. early it did absolutely yeah and you could see they were all just not in the right position you know I think it was Connolly had to backtrack to try and get the ball back and didn't and yeah, yeah we were straight on the back foot from that and then that not the confidence <laughs> and we've often puffed really haven't we but we've not really had a chance to, well we could have we've got to win 3-1 <laughs> we've got to win 3-1 okay yeah. do you know do you reckon we can come back we always I mean I've said it at the start of the season and it has been on here we do come back usually in the second half yeah we are a good second half team so I'm hoping so. I'd love a goal here. How nice would that be? Like? Yeah, absolutely. It would be great, wouldn't it? All right, we're all we're coming back out for the second half. Get up! Touch! Bang!
coming in. By far the better side, I would yeah. say. I'm Lee, Lee Blaper. Oh, Lee, all right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What do you think? Um, I think. Uh, I think we were lucky today, to be honest. At the end, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I think we, we played well, but yeah. uh, after I think they had the edge. But yeah. I'm not quite sure if they're Premier League. No, I'm no, not. Either. No. Uh, unfortunately, got a couple of bad injuries as well for them, which is a shame. Isn't yeah, it? Adibayo at the end there. Yeah. I think he yeah. pulled his it hamstring. I'm the captain. I think he looked a bit of hamstring in that yeah. to me. Yeah. All right, never mind. All right. Point will do. All right, see you later. <laughs> what do you think, Jordan? Good. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> My uncle won the pen, so. Okay, you'll see Jay's nephew. Nephew, all right. What's that, I'll see Jay's nephew. Do we deserve the draw? I want it. I Deserved another pen. Very happy, because, yeah. yeah. But, but we should have won. We could have won, won, but so could they. Yeah. We were good, we were value for the draw, to be honest. I think they were great, I thought we were okay. Yeah. I don't know how they could expect to go up. I think we were brilliant from the second half as well. Yeah. Can't knock can't not the commitment, I can't knock Marvin Epitaia, he was fantastic through that. Yeah, he was. This is great. Well, this is it, and again, we need to keep in that shit. If he goes, we're done. Simple as that. <laughs> Oh, a brilliant uh, draw. Um, yeah. Considering we're getting to the game, expecting a defeat. To get a point out of a team who's in the top six is absolutely brilliant. Yeah. 
and um, we need to keep hold of Epiteta, what a defender. Yeah, if we lose him and Bola, then we need to Come replace on. them significantly well. What a draw, Who's thank you. Come on, you crutches, well done. What have you done? I sprained my ankle. Sprained your ankle. Come on, the pro. Well deserved today, mate. Yes, indeed. Have a good day, Lee Charles. See you later. My dad loves you. Uncle CJ as well, my brother. Oh, your uncle CJ as well. You're another one. Okay, what's your name? Um, Mason. Mason. Yeah, well, I'm from the draw. Yeah, it's very. Do you think it was a fair result? Yeah, it's my it's my third black ball game. All oh, right. Well, well, your your uncle's fantastic. Yeah. He's fantastic. You happy? I'm very happy. Yeah. After, be, after going one nil down in the first few minutes, definitely. Yeah. We'll take Absolutely. It See they expect him to go into the Premier League next year, they've got another thing coming to us. They'll get battered. Hey, it's Gary Medine, he's a goal machine. Yes, and he knows what do you think of the game? Uh, I thought it was fair, I would say. I thought we kind of shaded Second half we were better, could, weren't we? They could have won it. Second half we were better. Um, just a load of pump. We're not much better than, um, not, not much worse than them, I don't no, think. No, we gave them a good game. We didn't yeah. get beat 4-0 like that, no, but you're made for Cadbury. I know, yeah. I'm just doubly, lovely. What do you think of the draw, is it? Yeah, yeah happy with that, yeah. yeah. I think we should have won. We were the better team. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Good. Yeah. He's Gary Muddy. That's what you are doing. See you later. Good game, loved it. Yeah, good game. Second half, we're a better side. I thought we were a better side first half. Yeah, we were, yeah. We just had a little breakdown again, didn't they? But as far as I'm concerned, they were a better side. Are you happy with that? Yeah. She should have won it. I should have won it. Yeah. yeah. Oh well. Take a draw. All over. Yeah, yeah. Go again next season. Yeah. Push the playoffs. Do you think they'll get up in the playoffs then? No, no chance. Forest or Huddersfield probably for me. Yeah, I think so as well. They didn't all that good, did they? No, no, no. They didn't. We looked all right. Yeah, we did. Yeah. We did. Confident, fit, good end to the season, then push on next year. Yeah. Yeah. Lee Charles, I know you are. It was brilliant. Yeah, yeah, Bowler should have been a pen, but Gary Bedeeds wasn't, but we still scored it. Yeah, I thought Bowler was a pen. Yeah, but he didn't give it. I think he got it the wrong way around. Yeah. But <laughs> good point. Good up point. Who's your favourite player? CJ. Yeah, he holds mums down there. Oh, that's really lovely actually. I've had some really lovely comments today. Yeah. And I'm glad he's doing well here. Oh, he's doing brilliant. Yeah. I bet you're proud of him today. He did some great stuff. Oh, some great blocks today. Oh, I was very proud of him today. Do you yeah. follow him all the time? Yeah, I do. Any club that he's been to, I always follow him, yeah. Right. We, we go to as many as we can, yeah. Okay, it's well. a long way to travel now for me, you see, because we're in Essex. Yeah, of course. So yeah. Um, this is lovely to be able to come yeah. today. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad you saw a good game. Okay, right, thank, thank you. you. Safe journey. Oh,